set for a start. First race of the afternoon, Flair goes up from behind. And away they go from the 1,250 meter mark in the first race. After the rain, as expected, straight to the front, pushes forward to be the leader by about one and a half lengths. Silver Falcon's also up there in a handy position, but races away in second. Then it's a further length back and running to Warrior, who's racing away in third. Resonates occupies that full spot, currently racing about five to six lengths off the pace. It's a nice, strong gallop out in front. And at the back end of the field, it's hood spread with Wheat and Go All Night. And there's about six to seven lengths separating top to tail, as they're about to take the angle in towards the top of the straight with just over 700 meters left to go. After the rain, out in front, going to try and go barrier to bot, shows the way by two lengths. Silver Fault in the white sleeves and pink cap battle on the inside rail in second. Resonates moved up to race alongside that one in third, then comes Warrior. We can go all night, hooked out deepest of all in the yellow cap, starting to make headway. And at the back end of the field is Hood Spread, has about six lengths to find. As they're into the final 300 meters after the rain, under pressure, Silver Fault in the first one to move up into challenge. Resonates sits deeper out on the track with We can go all night. It's after the rain that's hanging tough. Silver Fault in really starting to move into the race smartly after the rain on the inside silver falcon it's a match race on the inside after the rain silver falcon hits the line silver falcon i think just gets there from after the rain then came we can draw nice was further back and running hood spread then came resonation warrior Well, when it looked like after the rain was going to run out silver falcon moved up on the outside but after the rain hanging tough on the inside rail but silver falcon has he made it five wins in a row the line comes and he gets there, I think, just on the line. Silver Fulton gets there, number four, from after the rain. He finished back in second, just a nose, separating first and second. But we will wait for confirmation from the judge. And then I can say it was a good five lengths back to Wheat and Go all night. We finished up in that third placing, that's number six. And then that fourth spot was number five, Resonates, followed by Hood Spray and Warrior, who both will be needing further. The one of the white pink cap, the sheepskin noseband two from the right hand side into the final 200 meters it became a match race between the striking gray on the inside after the rain and silver Fulton. but a brilliant ride by Grand Finito gets him up into the winner's box for the first race of the afternoon and certainly a great way to start racing here. Hollywood bets Durbanville number four silver Fulton, the winner for race number one.